In order for a computer to function, it requires three things. The hardware, the software that runs on the desktop, and an operating system which allows the software and the hardware to communicate with each other. Ubuntu Linux is a free and open source operating system developed by Canonical, which is a Mark Shuttleworth initiative. Late last year, Mark launched his new Linux distribution known as Ubuntu for the first time in South Africa when he presented it to the media and the computer industry. We asked him how well it had been received. Globally, there's been a tremendous response to the release of Ubuntu. And uh, within a month, we were number three on the global charts. So the community seems to have responded very well, and I hope that the South African business community and press will, uh, will enjoy it as well. Mark, I believe with Ubuntu, if you phone a number or log onto a website, you can get it delivered to you for free. Is that true? We've had tremendous requests. We've had uh, 340,000 CDs printed and requested to be shipped around the world, which is uh, extraordinary. We've committed to making Ubuntu absolutely freely available with, without restrictions. What kind of target market are you approaching? Um, I think the time is right for open source to step into the home and into the small office and into the, the, the corporate um, and on the desktop. What makes Ubuntu different to other distros? While this is a fully commercially supported distribution, it, all of the software applications are absolutely open source software. Um, the, 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 the packaging includes two CDs, one which you could use to install um, a complete Linux environment on, on a new PC, so it becomes the only software running on that PC, and then also a live CD, um, which you can boot off on a Windows PC and experience Linux, or which if you install on a Windows PC will actually give you a bunch of open source applications for Windows. Ubuntu comes bundled with a complete office suite and internet applications like mail and browser. The server versions of these are also included for any companies wanting to build their infrastructure.